What compelled me to even consider this? Uh, it's October. That's what compelled me to consider this. And I'm a... I'm an idiot. <laughs> to, put it, to put it frankly, I'm, I'm an idiot. That is what compelled me to do this. This is one a hell of an intro as well. I remember that much. This is one just amazing intro to the game. So I'm going to shut up and let it play. Final report of the commercial starship Nostromo. Third officer reporting. The other members of the crew. Kane. Lambert. Parker. Brett. Ash and Captain Dallas are dead. Cargo and ship destroyed. I should reach the frontier in about six weeks. With a little luck, the network will pick me up. This is Ripley. Last survivor of the Nostromo. Signing off. Oh God. Yep, scared of the dark, terrible horror games, playing a game that heavily features both. What could go wrong? I know, right? Well, I'm a little low down for this. This this opening cutscene, remember, is a bit balked. Look at my feet down there. <laughs> My little footsies. Alright. I need to actually... I don't want to reset. It's fine. It's fine the way it is. Look at my footsies. Look at my tootsies. Let me kick my sandals around. Press A to sign in. Yes, this is a seated game and it's... Yeah, it's, um, obviously this is a flat screen game, but it has a VR mod, so, yes. I'm a little tall as well for this. I may adjust my height if it's a little much. Yeah, because I'm just going to start blacking out as I go through doorways, so I am indeed going to change my height slightly. Oh, my ankles are clipping through the ground, so this is fine. Ah, oh, God. And the fucking... The God damn... I hate these so much. Like, I love them, but I hate them so much. This is such a cool idea for a... For a save point. And the fact that it's like, oh yeah, we're not going to tell you when it's... Well, sorry, we are going to tell you if you're in danger. Which just adds to everything. Ugh. That is one thing that is weird about this, is that you just, you're like this to the terminal, so you have to back up a little bit. Early, you're on the lookout for the n navigational officer. Verlaine, rather. I have a friend that's just lost his ship and he's looking for work. I can vouch for him, he's got good papers. Same old story, the Megacorp's undercut him, picked up all his clients. Contracts are getting harder to come by for the smaller companies. I'm thinking of getting out myself while I still have something to sell. Sounds like you're doing okay, though. Dropped by the docks and heard you just shipped out. Savasswell Station. What a shithole. I still hear Whale and Utani pay well. Good luck to you. If you can't beat them, if you can't beat them, right? Let's catch up when you get back. Blaine. Boo. Get spooked. Ah, I've been spooked. Hello, Death Muncher. I'm going to have a shower. Audio sounds fine to everyone, right? Uh, uh, shower. Look at my feet. Look at my tootsies. I have feet. I actually have feet for once in a video game. Uh, stream sounds okay? Yes, cool. Marvelous. Have a shower. This is fine.
They aren't real feet. This is true. This is true. They have fake feet. I don't think this character has a back. No, it doesn't. I was going to say, I can't look at my own butt. Ignore that I said that. There we go. Now I have clothes and fancy sneakers. Look at them fancy sneakers. <clears throat> boop, boop. Alright, get to the bridge. Oh, God, fucking vent. <laughs> Hate vents. Vents of pain. Look at that dust. I'm totally distracting myself because I know that it's going to get real bad all of a sudden. Like, it's... I know that the alien doesn't turn up for a while in this game. But... Still doesn't make it bloody creepy. What do you want, big man? The reflections, I must admit, are a little weird in this game. They kind of follow my eye. Like, when you stand still, they look fine, but when you look around, all the... It looks like I've got glass in front of my face. I realize it's a very similar model to... The Nostromo. Yes. M-Class. A later pattern, but close. They do. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. Is Taylor up yet? She's not a seasoned traveler. Hypersleep may have been punishing for her. Haven't seen her. I'll go check on her. Hi, Samuels. What a nice man. I don't just. I can't quite reach up in my seat. God damn it! <laughs> I was gonna. Say, I'm gonna give him a kiss on the back of the head. Taylor. Good morning. Ripley, it's certainly not good. I very much doubt it's morning either. Sorry. Hello. I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You get used to it. I don't do long haul very often. Most legal execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Wayland Yutani felt the need to send legal at all. The loss of the Nostromo and its cargo cost the company a lot of money. It's important we find out what happened. If I can close the case with a conclusive accident report, it'll look great with my superiors. I'm sorry. That was insensitive. So what can you this is some fun socks. Absolutely they should. <laughs> it's okay. We'll both get what we want, right? Uh, have you seen Samuels? He's probably been up for hours. Yes, I did see him. All personnel to the bridge, approaching Sevastopol Station. Looks okay, like okay. Let me read this first. And press my face right up against this terminal. <laughs> hey Taylor, I got your case request. It may take a while to dig out the files. The incident happened before my time at the company, so I'm a bit fuzzy on the details. In 2000, 2,120, the Weyland-Yutani cargo vessel USCSS Nostromo went missing. No trace was found of the cargo or crew. Apart from the new science officer, the rest of the crew had worked together before, seven and all. Dallas, Ash, Kane, Ripley, Lambert, Parker, Brett. Well, I'm telling you, you lost a lot of money uh, from it. It's a bit of a black mark in the history. Get the impression they don't like to mention it. Anyway, I'll try and find the files later. Clarified some of the points. If you want, I can help you go through them. Maybe some of your luck will rub off on me. I hear upstairs have an eye on you for something big, so. Fair enough. Where is manifest? Yada yada yada. I don't care. The inside of her lip is not rendered. Was it actually? I didn't even realize. Oh. Oh wait. Music. You wanted a Walkman. Jesus Christ, that's a comically large stereo. Ah. When the world was much younger than it is now, people told and believed a great many wonderful stories about wonderful things. Rip off David Attenborough. <laughs> this is budget David Attenborough. Hope you all yo yo. Restful journey. The yes. Is in very good order for an old M class captain. She was a wreck when I bought her. Took a few years and a lot of contracts to refit. She pays for herself now. You said we're approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we docking? I believe your contact is Marshal Waits. Is that right? I'll hail Sevastopol. Inside of a lip. Rendered. Oh, hello. Good. Let's get this done. 
Yeah, it's it's rendered. I think. In and out. Connor, how we doing? SMG loaded and calibrated. Approach vector locked. Prep con so I can say hello. Yeehaw. Channel open, Captain. Does everyone have their briefing documents? You can watch the approach on the monitors. I'm gonna quickly. I want to look at the uh, what's it called. Hello. Ooh. Can you not suck me forwards, please? Why am I getting? Bro, you're looking down from a high angle. Oh, hi. You are pushing me. Don't push me. That's rude. <laughs> Sorry. I just love how in VR, on flat screen it's hard to tell, but I love how in VR you can very clearly tell that that's just a flat painted on skybox. Let me see on this side. Yeah. It's very clearly just a flat painted on skybox. I mean, it makes sense, but it's funny. You're looking down from a high angle. Fair enough. Fair enough. God, look at the detail though. God, isn't that cool? Look at the detail on this. On the ship. That's so cool. I love that so much. Everything looks super neat. I love the aesthetic of the um of the Torrens and the Nostromo, like the M-Class ships in Alien. It's super duper sick. I love the aesthetic. Alright, cutscene. Can we see it? Switch to monitors. Sevastopol Station. Is that damage? It looks like damage. Punch up 74, tight angle. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. I can't bring the Torrens into that. This is a commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV7760, calling Sevastopol Traffic Control. We're carrying three passengers on a whale and Utani Bond. You're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers port side over. This waits Colonial Marshal Sebastopol State in serious situation. Hello, Marshal? Mar Marshal, this is the Torrens. Say again. So cool. Stuff of the panels above isn't detailed though. This is true. Station this is true. You're not supposed to look up. Screwed up, so I fitted Samuel's suit with a radio booster. I can only keep the Torrens in transit for 24 hours. You'll have heard from us by then. Safe trip. Stand by. My contract doesn't cover bloody spacewalks. It's the only option. And it's perfectly safe if you do what I tell you. Depressurizing. Oh, fuck. Hating this. Just shadow me, Taylor. You too, Samuels. Affirmative. I also love how space is, like, mostly accurate in this. To an extent, obviously. But it mimics the old, the alien movie very, very well. The fact that you can't You're hear anything. There is something in here. Taylor Ripley, hold on! Samuel! Taylor! Respond! Anybody! Okay. Like that. That's cool. The fact that you could hear that you could hear the lever being pulled because she was hanging on to it and could hear it through her suit, but couldn't hear the, the, the airlock key pressurizing. That's a little goofy, however, admittedly. Ah, <sighs> very cool.
Is this spooky land? This is spooky land. We're in the spooky land now. We're in the spooky land. We are aboard. Can you change back out? N no, you can't change back into your suit. Hee 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 hee. Look, it's dark. It's dark, everybody. Look at that. Ain't that fun? Ha 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 ha. Fun. Cock and ball torture. Yes. This is where I played two up in the test. Collect scrap. In, in when I tested this yesterday, this is where I played up to, like literally right this that save point, just to make sure it worked well in VR. Volumetric fog, not a fan. Darkness, not a fan. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Hey, look at the flame. Oh god, don't fucking walk below vents. Flame! I remember seeing that as well. Oh no! This is just a little turbulence. Oh god, I remember this now. This is this is the um This is the introduction to the butthole vent. Oh cock and ball torture. I hate that so much. I know there's no alien yet. God, that dust is dusty. I know there's no alien yet, but oh, I hate that so much. Dusty. Spooky. Scrap. I like how this is technically a survivor ho survival horror game. What happened? Read a terminal to to quell the mind. Folder corrupted. Nice. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Degrinishing. So, boys and girls, you've probably heard the whispers about Svasov by now. I cannot confirm it's official. Svasov is being commissioned. I'll go over with. I'll go over with each of you what each of this means in regards to your contracts and next placement. But for now, we still have a job to do. The suits want this done with a skeleton crew, which means it'll be, which does mean overtime. I recommend taking what you can <coughs> while it's available. I should point out that the decommission does not mean the lucky dip. Everything here has to be accounted for, and I'll personally escort anyone found helping themselves to equipment to Marshal Waits, Chief. Alright. Everything's still looking good on the stream? Ow. Cock and ball torture. What about that? That freaked me out. Not gonna lie. I've I I admit. Oh, God. the flares! The flares! The 
Flares. Oh, don't like that. Excuse me. Someone new, you always know, working Joe. You're all alone now, I am. Yep, I'm totally, completely alone. Keep moving, alrighty. Alrighty, if you say so. Click scrap. I don't have any flares. Scrap. I'm gonna turn this off. Stop it. And another flare. Good. Good, good. Good, good. Oh, that's cool. Hello? Anyone here? Such a cool aesthetic. God, this game looks so pretty. I hear the pinging of a save point. Forgotten? This life for rent. Use these terminals to update your map with unexplored areas. Use the B to open the map. Update map. Okay. Yeesh. I like how it updates that with actual, like, views, rather, like, of your head. Now, oh, save game. <sighs> Alright, use. Oh god. Clunk. 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 Power's back up, baby! Something didn't like that, baby! Access terminal. Uh, can I close this door, please, before I access the terminal. I'd really appreciate that. I don't like it. Oh god. Game didn't like that. Langley, if you're looking for a stash, I've moved it. You left it right out of the open where anyone could have taken it. Jesus, do you know what what I had to get it? I've hidden one of the I've hidden it in one of the storerooms. Should be able to find it. the code is 0340. So 300 so yeah. 34. Don't worry. No one goes down in the terminal anymore. Not after what happened. Also, we're out of meds on lower water, so you're going to need to get some. It's your turn. Maybe I'll teach you to take care of our stuff in the future. Anna. From Siegson. Public notice. Decommissioning of Smashville Station. We've had a long journey together, but sadly it's coming to an end. Siegson Corp would like to take this opportunity to thank you all who worked and lived here at Smashville Station over the years and hopes that Siegson has helped to make it in a productive and rewarding environment. Our investment and belief in the station has never wavered. Be assured that Season, Season's Apollo Central AI and working Joe androids will be there to serve Spaswell until the last rivet is removed. Wish you all the very best for the future. After all, Spaswell isn't just a station, it's people. Season Corp. Yeah, right. Harris, Turner, get back here now. We have a track somewhere in engineering. Lock the terminal down, kill the power, and don't forget your reports. Make them thorough. We're gonna need our paperwork to be bulletproof when this shit's over. Wait's up. Alright. So... I'm now restoring power to something that got deliberately low-powered. 
Uh, hello? So I'm not all alone. There are people. Who is that and why? Oh. Fuck, don't like that. Do not like that. Not a fan. At all. Can I go down here and see where those people went? I think I can, yeah. No, I can't. The door's locked behind him. That's right. It's in here, though. Bunning agent, charge track. Just the building settling. Yeah, sure, yeah, it's just... The station, yeah, it's just... Just settling. Yeah, of course. Of course. What, what else would it be? It's, it's nothing, you know, it's, it's, it's nothing. Take all the shit. Fill my pockets with that. Kick these things around like they're weightless. Okay, and now I can run. Oh, that's fun. Security checkpoint. Fucking ball torture. So, we are now on a very damaged, decommissioned... Very damaged, decommissioned um, space station that is falling apart. Make it version 1. Never access to the crafting engine and construct from acquired components. Left bumper to build. I don't have any... Ooh, that's hard to read. I have bonding agents. I don't have any of SCI injectors and I don't have any compound B. Yeah, right. How do I put this away, actually? I don't know how to put this away. I just have a flare now. Wow, that's so cool. What happened here? That planet is physically there, but that's so cool. Actually, no, I don't think it is. I think that's still part of the light wrap, but that's so cool. I love this aesthetic. So, 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 so cool. Ion torch required. What does that say? Is that saying Nostromo? I don't know. Anyway. Wow, that looks so cool. I love this. Like, this is the kind of thing, if if this was a, a sh like a, a ship, if we ever went into space, I genuinely believe that this kind of stuff is what it would look like. I know that Alien is a dystopian future, but I genuinely believe that this is what it would look like. All those kind of ships and stuff. I genuinely believe that this is what it would look like. Because look at that. Like, just the f I love all this stuff. The fact that, like, that is literally just... That's just an airport sign. That's just straight up just an airport sign. And that's what Sevastopol is. It's, it's an airport, but space. It's a spaceport. That's an Nostromo. The Torrens. Oh, the Torrens, rather. I'm here. I'm right here. Verlaine! 
That's so cool. Ah. Oh. And the blast shield doors coming down. Whoa. Fuck. 